Hi, it's Susan here and welcome to In The Craft Room. Since our last episode, I've stitched on the text panel applique underneath the central panel applique. And the reason why we did that was so we can begin our floral appliques on either side of the text. Today we're going to be working on the right side of the floral applique, which when working on it, turns out to be the left. To do our first lot of foxglove floral appliques on the right, you will need issues number 79, 80 and 81 of the Peter Rabbit Patchwork Quilt Partworks. You will also need the template sheets. On one side you have the templates, on the other is part of our design and I've photocopied the back of all of those sheets and put together our design that we'll be working on today. This is the right foxglove slash floral applique. Over the past few editions we've also been receiving the pieces of fabric for our applique as well as the templates and design. The fabrics that you should have also received include the green, the yellow, emerald green, pink, baby pink and this green. Over the four template sheets we've got well over 50 pieces that we need to trace onto our bonder web cut out and iron onto our fabric and that's why I have already done this step. This took a very long time and it's all here pre-done and ready to cut out. And here we have finally, after an hour of cutting, all of our pieces for our applique. There are actually 64 or so pieces to this applique if you include all of the petals for the foxglove. So it's a real testing one. Thanks for joining me today as we're on our journey of making our first foxglove applique. Cutting it all out was enough today, so join me next time when I place it onto our quilt and press it on. 
Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Please hit the subscribe button as well as the bell to be notified of future episodes. And I'll see you next time when we continue with this. Bye.